San Antonio is a city on the rise, and if you have traveled downtown or on Broadway recently, you probably noticed the construction of the new Jefferson Bank headquarters. It's expected to be completed next October, but Max Massey shows us the new building will be much more than just a bank. Take a look at this. This is the view from the eighth floor of what is soon to be the new headquarters for the Jefferson Bank on Broadway. And it's going to be so much more than just a headquarters for the bank. There's going to be stores. There's going to be retail. There's going to be bars. We're joined here with the president of Jefferson Bank, Paul McSween. So, Paul, why did you guys pick Broadway? You know, we spent many years, I guess six or seven years, looking at San Antonio, trying to find the ideal location to consolidate all of our Look, all of our operations and uh, we're very excited about the energy that's down here. We feel like that uh, in terms of recruitment and retaining top talent, uh, this is the place that employees want to be. Uh, we see the banking industry as really moving towards a technology kind of business with all of the digital channels and digital uh, service platforms that we offer. Uh, so uh, those kind of folks love it down here. They love the Pearl. They love this area of Broadway. What does the future of the San Antonio economy look like from your perspective? We're very bullish on the San Antonio economy. We see a lot of demand for this building already from companies that are outside of San Antonio. Uh, we see a lot of companies outside of San Antonio that would have historically looked at Houston or Dallas or Austin, particularly Austin for the technology side, are now looking at San Antonio. Uh, San Antonio has been kind of a hidden little jewel for many years and uh, now companies are starting to take notice. So there's a lot of attention. All right, Paul, thank you so much. If you guys have any questions about the project or what is to come here at the Broadway Corridor, we have those answers. Head to KSAT.com. Max Massey, KSAT 12 News.